Hello guys, how are you doing? This is Tech Rita here with another video. We will fix NetHelp MSG 2182 problems with BitService. So, so let's get started. To do this, simply type services, MSC in the search area, and open the services app. Locate the BitService and make sure its startup type is set to manual. Also, check the status column and restart or start it should it be stopped. Users can't get Windows apps or updates when the Net Help MSG 2182. Press the Windows key plus S keyboard shortcut to open settings. Then you can click Troubleshoot from the left pane. Then you can go through the Windows Update Troubleshooter for potential fixes. To open the Bits Troubleshooter, press the Windows plus R keyboard shortcut. Enter Control Panel in the open box and select the OK option. Click Troubleshooting to open the Control Panel applet shown directly below. Click View All on the left of the window to open the list of troubleshooters. Then click Background Intelligent Transfer Service to open that troubleshooter. Click Advance to select the Apply Repairs Automatically option, and then press the Next button. Type CMD in the Windows search bar. Select the command prompt, admin option to launch an elevated prompt window. Before initiating the SFC scan, enter the following command in the command prompt and press return to fix Windows 10 image corruptions. Enter SFC slash scano and press return to run the system file checker scan, which might take about half an hour or longer. Restart the desktop or laptop if the SFC scan does repair system files. Press the Windows key and type CMD in the search box. Right-click on the result for command prompt and select Run as Administrator. Input the following commands and press Enter after entering each one to turn off Windows Update. Next, input the below command and press Enter. That command will rename Software Distribution to Software Distribution Old. Then type the next command and press Enter. To restart Windows Update, input the commands below separately and press Enter after each one. Enter Command Prompt in Windows 10 search box. Right-click Command Prompt to select its Run as Administrator Context menu option. Then enter WES Reset dot X in the Command Prompt window and press the Return button. Restart Windows after clearing the MS Store cache. Thanks for watching. Hope this helped. If so, hit like and subscribe for more content.